Hey guys, Eclipse14 here, and welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario. Alright, still running through the Toad Town tunnels, but activating the Forever Forest pipe allowed me a bunch of strange leaves. Which now means more tasty recipes. About time. Alright, so I needed four of them, as well as two apples, in order to make some stuff. And we're gonna go ahead and finish everything up right now. Actually, where do I have item-wise? Um... I actually need to go to Harry's shop in order to get stuff I need. So we'll roll on here. Open the door. And here we go. In this case, I'll run some claim. Oh, wait, I need to store what has been dealt with. Guys, I'm down to three items. Wow. May as well do this cookie cookie. And finally the yummy meal. And yeah, we fully capped out. Wow. <laughs> um, okay, so I'll take a lime. I also need to take the melon. I'll cover the stinky herb. And I'll cover that. So, the lime and the melon will cover both the apple recipes. So, for now, we'll go ahead and go in here. Let's get this started. First things first, we are going to go with the stinky herb and strange leaf. A weird design, but it'll become something interesting. Dizzy Dial. Huh, how about that? Alright, now the next thing we're going to do. In which case, we're going to do the apple. And the melon. This is a special shake for 20 flower points. You still need this for fusion with the dried shrew, so don't use it. Anyway, let's cover the apple and the lime. This should be fine. Super soda. Alright. Good to go. Alright, so now that that's done, I can do a few more checks on stuff I don't need. I also can sell the Dizzy Dial because I don't need that. Quickly get over here. Sell the Dizzy Dial because I don't need it. Is there anything else really of importance? No. Whoops, I pressed up thinking I would go. No, apparently. Okay, so dried fruit and strange leaf mixed together. I also need to get the cake mix. And what else did I need to pick up? Um, the dried shrimp, right? Should be fine. Alright. Let's finish off these. In which case, I'll cover the dried fruit and the strange leaf. I'll wrap this up. ends up turning into a fire flower. A weird thing, especially for an item that's actually pretty good healing-wise, but it is a recipe. Speaking of recipes, strange leaf and cake mix. Finally, all the cake mix recipes are done. Thank God. Let's 
strange cake electrifies, turns him transparent, or falls asleep. No real extra bonuses? Wow. Well, in any case, special shake and dried shrimp. This becomes the Healthy Juice, which is 40 flower points. Very nice. Okay. One last item we can use with the Strange Leaf is an egg. I think I have one in the inventory. But I'll find out soon enough. If not, I can just go to Mount Rugged. I have to go to the station anyway. Because of one of the letters. Anyway, I am going to sell that Strange Cake for 10 coins. Doesn't do any real bonuses, apart from all that stuff. And... It's, it's fine. Okay, so... Claim, do I have an egg? Yes, I do. And I'll go ahead and... Whoops, I hit that again. Check. In which case, I'll check the Fire Flower. As well as the Healthy Juice. Leaves all that, that's fine by me. Okay then. Roll on. Egg. Strangely. Only a few more recipes left to go at this point. Get that, and it becomes a boiled egg for 8 and 8. Alright, that's fine. Don't know why you need a strange leaf to boil the egg, but... I mean, egg by itself becomes fried egg, so maybe that's... I, I don't know. Anyway, um... Actually, I need to head south. Go all the way. Yeah, there was one the the one Koopa Village. Oh wait, I actually did have business there. Shoot. I should take care of that soon. In any case, where is Where is he? Dane is this one. Run this, hit the letter, continue the chain. Oh man. You poor sucker. Weird how this turned from a fishing trip thing to this. With that, we gotta go back to Lava Lava Island. Fortunately, I already triggered the pipe to get there. And, well, that's pretty much it for now. I mean, I'll cover some more recipes later, but there's only a couple things left to do. Alright, back into the tunnels we go. Wait, this is the wrong place. I completely skipped it, didn't I? Derp. 
That's what I get for misremembering the split. <laughs> and I lost my speech there, too. Great. Well, in any case, now we are where we should be. Go down the hole. In which case, I'll just head towards the Yoshi Village first. Alright, there's the red Yoshi kid. Go on over here. <laughs> oh crap, I forgot. Parrot carrying. Let's get this. I mean, there's a pipe now available that takes you to Toad Town Tunnels. Goes back to Dane T. Alright then. We're done here. Back down the pipe. And now I need to bring sushi back. I guess while I'm here, I'll make my way over to Koopa Village and deal with the other letter. He's going up this way. Center pipe. I assume this is going to be the Toad House. Which one is it? That's the shop. Of course it's this one. Open the door. Skip. Peace. And alright, now I can just continue on with where I left off. Head back to the tunnels and bring back the letter to Dane. Just gotta go all the way to the end of the path. Alright. Now I just gotta run it back. should be, and there's Day. And I'm pretty sure this is all the same stuff. Yup, it is. Same text. Hit the letter.
And with that, we have the letter that stops the chain for now, as we haven't reached Starborn Valley yet. Anyway, with that all now done, past 15 minutes, well, I guess I can move on through the rest of the tunnels. I don't see anything else I can do right now. Drop down. And I guess I gotta go this way. Wait, maybe I gotta go this way. Yeah, because that went to Forever Ford. Okay, yeah, I have to go this way because I haven't went farther than that because of Forever Forest. But up there is a super block. There's a spot. In which case, yeah, you had that block if you wanted to do it that way, but with the Ultra Boots, that's not necessary. I do, however, still need Paracarry. I was on the wrong plane the whole time. Shoot. That was an accident. Try it again. There we go. Now I can write. Super block. On bed, paracarry, sushi, laka. Ah, what the hell, paracarry. I've been using him a bunch this episode. I may as well give him his well deserved ultra rank. And that's that. Okay, then. So that's it for that area. Let's get past that. Let's get past all of you. Move on through. Still can't open the door. Hmm. There's gotta be something. Because I think that's the way into where I need to be. I think. Of course, this is Cheat Rippo. Rip Cheeto, actually. Yes. Okay, looks like I might need to just search around off camera to figure out what to do next. In the meantime, I'm now up to 16 star pieces. I can finally get the one badge that I really want to go after with the HP drain. So I'm going to head back to Merlo and get that badge. Just spin my way there, whatever. It makes no difference to me. Alright. Step on in. And let's go ahead and get the badge I'm waiting for. Hey. Yep. I know exactly what I want. HP Drain. Three. Eh, not the worst. Decreases Mario's attack power by one and restores an HP per turn. Oh, wow, it's a drop. Well, that's a shame. Yeah, I don't have enough star pieces to continue anything. Alright, that's that. And I am approaching 20 minutes, so a little progress got made, and that's perfectly fine. Uh, I just gotta figure out how to properly get into Shiver City, because that's where I need to go next. Unless I gotta speak to somebody beforehand. I'm not sure. Well, in any case, I'll figure it out. And next episode, we will be heading for Shiver City, because there's not really much else I need to do. 
otherwise, apart from just hunt down Chuck Quizmo a bunch of times. So, I'll save the game here, and with that, I'm gonna go ahead and cut this episode here, and we'll approach Silver City next episode. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.